crucial Democratic presidential primaries, Indiana, North Carolina. It's a giant story. And uh, yeah, for the first time in a long time, a lot of young people seem excited, involved, interested. The whole country is fascinated with this race. But we have one person here at our show, one person who just doesn't seem that interested. I'm talking about one of our show's graphic designers, Pierre Bernard. There he is. <laughs> That's a real photo. Uh, let's bring him out here right now. Ladies and gentlemen, Pierre Bernard. So, Pierre, is it true that you're not particularly interested in today's Democratic primaries? I couldn't care less, Conan. That's what, but, but you do care passionately about sci-fi television shows and Japanese anime, is that right? Yes, I do. Okay, then I have an idea. Let's discuss the Democratic primaries in terms you can really relate to in a little segment we like to call Nerding It Up for Pierre. Nerding It Up for Pierre! All right, Pierre, <clears throat> let's just say that Barack Obama and Hillary Clinton are mortal enemies. Kind of like the Wraith and the Athosians on season one of Stargate Atlantis. Oh, so Obama wants to destroy Hillary by deciphering the ancient technology like Major Shepard and Theosian leader Taylor? <laughs> I thought you were interested in this crap. <laughs> Why can't you pronounce it? <laughs> anyway, actually... Uh, He's just trying to keep her from taking over, like season three self-replicating Assyrian nanobots. Okay, now I understand. Yeah, and today's, today's primaries could be a big turning point, kind of like the trial of Gaius Baltar and Battlestar Galactica. I hope Obama doesn't perjure himself like Lieutenant Gator. Yeah, well, don't worry, he won't. And remember, Pierre, both Obama and Clinton are hoping to gain the favor of superdelegates, kind of like the super cyborgs on Mobile Sweet Gundam or Mazinger Z. Wow, I had no idea the Democratic primaries were so incredibly fascinating. I'm glad... Wow. This crowd knows true feeling when they see it. And I'm glad you feel that way, Pierre. Maybe you'll even vote in the next election. Well, I would, Conan, but due to an internet misunderstanding, I'm now a registered sex offender. <laughs> so long, everybody. All right, then. Good time to stand in to take a little break. When we come back, my name is Earl's Jason Lee's on the show. We'll see you in a second.